crystal bowl cure migraines? Is laughter really the best medicine of all? <laughs> I'm Portland Helmick. Join me as I travel the globe exploring some of the most bizarre, radical healing practices you've ever seen. Do you feel like ghost energy sometimes? Oh, Are you yeah. able to pick that up? Oh yeah? This is extreme healing. Today, we are in the beautiful city of Boston. You know, you hear a lot these days about how laughter is good for the body. Well, there's this doctor in India, and he's taken this idea, and he's run with it. He created laughter clubs, and they've spread throughout the world. But what kinds of healing benefits can you really get from something like this? I think it's the endorphins, the act of laughing. <laughs> Lowers your blood pressure, helps with arthritis. When I started coming here, I stopped taking Prozac completely. I think that feels like if you die and you go to heaven, that's what happens. So now we're heading north to visit a woman who does space clearing. She goes into people's homes with a pendulum and a dowsing rod, and she clears energetic disturbances away. So it's pointing you? It is pointing me, and I can feel it as I, as I enter into the spot. I prick it, and I collapse it. You don't have to pray, you don't have to hum, nope, you don't have to chant. You, you're just standing there talking. You know what talking. it is? It's basically naming it, feeling it and being compassionate. Interesting. I actually just felt a tingle. I Did really, you? Yeah, yeah, I think when you said husband, yeah. the husband, I just felt this sort of like, mm. I never know what's going to happen when I arrive. It's just such a mystery, and it's so much fun. Network chiropractic is a technique that involves light touch along the spine to stimulate a relaxation response. Mm. Is it like an orgasm? <laughs> it's ecstatic, it's opening. I want some of that. <laughs> Can I try? I'm sliding right into the spinal gateway, which is the place that feels great, and you're moving into it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All of this tension. Yeah. I like it. So how did I get into this stuff? I actually started out as an actor, but I got really burned out living in New York City. So I moved to Vermont. I actually became friends with people who were like shamanic practitioners and past life regression therapists and energy healers. I was fascinated by this stuff. I write a blog about extreme forms of healing. I've written for all sorts of major magazines about healing. I created a national talk show about alternative forms of healing. Welcome to the show. I'm totally into this stuff. I have learned that there are countless ways to heal the body and the mind. Some of these ways might be wacky, but others might really get you thinking. Come on, let's go.